Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys if you're having a problem opening up executable files on your Windows device. This tutorial will show you guys how to fix that pretty quick. So we're going to jump right into it and we are going to start by heading over to the start menu and we're going to left click on it. Now you want to type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match that comes up should say regedit here. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. So now that we're in the registry editor, we want to either double click on the hkey classes root folder right here or left click and expand it by clicking on this little arrow next to it, whichever one you prefer. And what we're going to do here is scroll down until we get to the .exe folder. And it should be alphabetical here, so it should be pretty easy to find. Should be something that says .exe. So where it says default here, you want to right click on it, left click on modify, first option in this menu, and then for value data, you want to make sure it says exe file, spelled out exe file, all one word, lowercase, no dots. Keep that in mind. So once you make sure your value data is set to that, you can click on OK just to save your string value. Again, make sure it's set to exe file. Now you want to scroll down this list again until you get to something that says exe file. Again, exe file right here. Up here underneath name, there should be something that says default again. Right click on it, left click on modify. And now this is very important for value data. You want to delete whatever's here and you want to type in exactly how it appears on the screen. I will likely put some information about this in the description of the video, exactly what you should type in here because it's kind of, I could see how someone could go down the wrong path. So you just want to make sure you type this in correctly. Okay, so you want to do a double quotation right above the comma key on your keyboard. Then you want to do a percent sign. Then type the number one. Then you want to do another double quotation mark. Again, another percent sign, and then you want to do a little star, which should be right above your 8 key on your keyboard. So it should be a little star. Looks like a snowflake, and I will paste this in the description of the video very likely. And then I'm going to click on OK to save the value data. So then once you're done doing that, you want to expand the exe file on the left side by double clicking on it or clicking the little arrow next to it. Then there should be something that says shell underneath. Click on that. You want to left click on the little arrow next to that. And then you want to select the open folder right here. So left click on that. You want to right click on the default value on the right side. Left click on modify. Now we're going to type in exactly what we did for the other one. So again, I probably will put this in the description of the video. I'm not going to read it aloud again, but I should have it up on the screen. Keep in mind there's no spaces at all. And then I'm going to click on OK to save that. And then once you're done doing that, you can close out of the registry editor and you should be good to go. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.